Hi guys, welcome back to the channel, hope you're all okay. I've come out today to do a range test on this radio here, the Zastone A18, which is the one with the uh, nice LED display there, uh, which you can't really pick up on camera, but I've done a review on this, so if you um, look in the description, you'll see a link to the review that I've done on this. So it's a decent radio, it's um, 5 watts out, and um, I thought I'd bring it up here today to see if we can access some repeaters. So I've done a recent test on the Zastone VW7, um, just the same as this, uh, where we pick repeaters between sort of two miles away and 75 miles away and see if we can open them. Um, and then the second part of the test will be like an urban range test, which I've done on a few radios in the past, where I drive around the local area um, and stop every sort of half a mile and see if we can get back home with these uh, with these radios. So we'll do the same with this one. So I've got some repeaters programmed in here. Um, so we'll just start at the bottom at the top of the list and we'll just work through and see uh, how many we can get into. I've also put a 70 centimeter simplex channel in just to put a call out. I'm not hopeful we'll get anyone back because 70 centimeters is dead. Um, around here but we'll give it a go anyway so the first repeater is GB3PZ which is in Duckingfield in Greater Manchester and that's 2.6 miles away M3HHY test turn the volume up M3HHY test ok so that worked no problem at all as you'd expect the next one is GB3MR which is in Stockport and that's 7 miles away station test in there is, uh, Yeah, thanks very much for that. Much appreciated. M three H H Y. That's good. Okay, so second one, as I say, is in Stockport, which is seven miles away. M three H H Y test. As you can see, we got into that one, no problem. Next one, GB three W P, which is in Hyde, which is two point four miles away. M3 HHY test. Okay, so got into that no problem at all. This one is GB3 KU and it is um, 5.6 miles away. I know I can get into that. It's in use, so I'm not going to. Uh, I'm not going to try. Uh, the next one is Liverpool GB3 LI. So that is over that way, 40 miles away, line of sight. M3 HHY testing GB3 LI. Okay, so with no problems into that one, uh, it's coming in loud and clear. And then the one after that is GB3CR, which is in Mould in North Wales, and that's 46 miles away. M3HHY testing GB3CR. So, with no problems into that one as well. Uh, next one, Blackpool GB3FC, and that is 50 miles away, line of sight. M3HHY testing GB3FC. So we're in that one, a little bit of interference from the local transmitter tower, but we're into that one. And then the last one is GB3LL, which is 75 miles away in North Wales, uh, in the town of Landudno. So we'll see if we can open that one. M3HHY, testing access GB3LL. That's really good. Um, we got into GB3LL, 75 miles away, line of sight off a, off a small handheld. So, um, yeah, happy with that. Um, this is sort of the benchmark test they use on all the radios I get. If we can get into those uh, repeaters, then we know uh, we know it's working well. So, um, yeah, happy with it. We'll just quickly put a call out on 70 centimeters simplex and just see if anyone's around. Hello, CQ, 70 centimeters, M3HHY, mobile, calling CQ on 17, standing by. nothing there as you'd expect um yeah 70 centimeters is really quiet around this neck of the woods so i'm not not too surprised about that but we know it works from up here we can get into all these repeaters um some of them don't come through as strong as uh, strong as you'd like but we uh, we know they work then so what we'll do is we'll take this down into the town like i did with the uh, with the other radios and we'll give it a test um in an urban environment so i'll just drive around the town stop at every half a mile or so and put a call out back home um, the antenna at home is a Diamond X300 on the roof, not that high, uh, so it's obviously not a fair test, a scientific test, because everyone's results will be different, but um, that's sort of the benchmark I use to know that they work for me, and it sort of gives a rough idea, an indication of how well this works in an urban environment. So we'll drive down into the town now, and we'll, uh, we'll give this a test. Cheers. 
Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at half a mile. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at half a mile. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at one mile. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at one mile. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at 1.5 miles. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at 1.5 miles. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at two miles. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at two miles. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at two point five miles. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at two point five miles. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at three miles. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, this is a test of the Zastone A18 at three miles. One, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, guys, that concludes the range test of the uh, Zastone A18. Um, really good radio. I'm happy with it. It performed well on the repeaters on both transmit and receive, and it's performed um, you know really well on the simplex test as well in in an urban built up area. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm happy with it. The build quality of this radio is fantastic. Uh, the audio quality out of it is fantastic for such a cheap radio. So yeah, I'm uh, I'm I'm happy with it, and the display is really cool as well. Um, so uh, yeah, nothing, uh, no negatives on that one. Pleased with it. Thanks for watching this one, guys. Really appreciate it. If you've not dropped me um, a comment yet, then drop us a comment below. If you've not subscribed, then make sure you subscribe and drop us a thumbs up. I uh, really like hearing from you guys, so make sure you do that. Um, if you've not watched my second channel yet and subscribed to it, it's Ringway Manchester 2. Link's in the description. It's going to be a bit like this channel, but um, with some other bits and pieces on there that quite don't fit with this channel. But it'll still be mainly sort of radio and drone themed. Uh, so if you like what you see on this channel, you'll like what you see on there. So um, go over there and hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys, as always. And we'll see you in the next one. 735.